people are in the little country uh, beach town of Yamba. It looks like you've created like such a wonderful little sanctuary. It looks like a little sanctuary. Yeah, yeah, mate. It's um basically the idea is to create like as you say a sanctuary where there's positive energy and and the idea behind it was to. Uh, to have somewhere where I can train, I can invite people in that are going to feel comfortable and, and um, be able to train in that, that sort of environment. That's the idea behind it, for sure. So, what, what yeah. was the what was the initial reason? Why did you start this? Well, I wanted this and, and initially for myself. I wanted a place where I could train. Yeah. You know, and you know, gyms. A lot of the gyms around here, I was working with as well. Mm -hmm. But I wanted somewhere which I could call my own. Yep. Um, and that's that's basically what I've created. You can sort of see, like, well, most of this gear is second hand. Yep. Um, it's uh, a lot. You'll find a lot of people when they buy stuff. They don't necessarily when they when they buy it, they you use it for a bit and then they don't use it again. Yeah, exactly. And so right. it was really easy to actually find a lot of the stuff. It was pretty much all brand new. That's it. Is that what you? I think. Well? I think with people, when, when when you decide to set something like this up, you don't need a big space either. You don't need to spend thousands, and thousands of dollars. I mean, I've spent decent money in here, but you have you don't have to go out of you know and create like this multi functional purpose center all in one. You can still do some quality stuff, do everything you really need to do in a small small space. Yeah. You know? So it works, works really well. Everyone yeah. enjoys it when they come around with friends and they come around and train. So yeah, yeah, it's a good spot. Oh yeah, those people are training and going hard and, and you can see some of the things I'll, I'll, I'll sort of run you through what this is is um first one, forty percent rule. Yeah. Um that's from the uh, the Navy SEALs. Yeah. And what does that mean? Well basically they, they work on the principle that when they train these guys, they, they basically work on the principle that when they get to about 40%, yeah. when they're broke, when they're done physically and mentally, they know they've still got 60% left. Yeah. So when you get to a stage in your life, whether it's um, relationships, whether it's um, training, all those things that you think you've got nothing left, your, your face is in the dirt, you've got 60% left. Yeah. And that's the principle they work on. And it's a great principle and they use it everywhere. Business people use it. Um, people in a whole range of different parts of life take yeah. on that principle, and I think it's a great one. That's awesome. Yeah, so yeah. We'll to run us through some of the other things that yeah. you've got on here. Yeah, um, what's your why? That's a uh, really, really important one. Why do, you, why do you get up in the morning? Why do you do what you do? Yeah. Um, what are the reasons that, that you know, want you to be a better version of yourself? Yeah. I mean, that's, that's, that's thrown around a lot by a lot of different trainers, and, and that's, it's, a, it's a great message, so keep repeating it. Exactly um, right. I'm not, I'm not sort of here to sort of preach to people. I just know that a lot of times in my life, when I've had had you know tough times, that what's the reason why you do it is what gets me up. 